Rafale Jets, Engineering Excellence and Strategic Power, an educational overview. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's educational session. Today, we are exploring one of the most advanced fighter jets in the world, the Dassault Rafale. Let's dive into its history, technology, latest updates, and its role in global defense. The Rafale is a twin-engine, multi-role fighter aircraft designed and built by Dassault Aviation of France. It first flew in 1986 and entered operational service with the French Navy and Air Force in the early 2000s. The word Rafale means gust of wind in French, symbolizing its speed and agility. Let's look at some key specifications. Top speed, approximately Mach 1.8, around 2,222 km per hour. Operational range, over 3,700 km with drop tanks. Engines, two Snecma M88-2 turbofans offering superior thrust-to-weight ratio. Armament equipped with a 30mm cannon, air-to-air -air missiles, air-to-ground precision weapons and nuclear deterrence capability. Radar latest RBE-2AA active electronically scanned array, ASA radar system. Uh, what makes the Rafale stand out? Well, its omniroll capability is one of the key features. This means one jet can perform air superiority, ground support, reconnaissance, and even nuclear strike missions, all in a single flight. Pretty impressive, right? Another standout feature is its stealth design. The Rafale is crafted with reduced radar cross-section through smart shaping, and the use of composite materials. This makes it harder to detect. Then there's the electronic warfare suite. The Spectra system provides cutting-edge electronic jamming, threat detection and decoy deployment. It's like having a high-tech shield in the sky. And let's not forget interoperability. The Rafale is compatible with NATO and Allied forces capable of integrating various weapon systems and data links. This makes it a truly versatile fighter jet. As of 2025, the Rafale is in service with several nations beyond France. India, for instance, operates the Rafale under a strategic deal for 36 jets. These are customized for Indian requirements, including additional radar enhancements and airframe reinforcements. Egypt was one of the first international customers to adopt the Rafale. Additionally, Qatar, Greece, Croatia and the United Arab Emirates have also inducted Rafales into their air forces. It's clear that the Rafale has a global footprint. But in 2025, the Rafale continues to evolve. The French armed forces are now fielding the Rafale F4 standard, featuring enhanced network-centric warfare capabilities, improved radar, optronics and helmet-mounted sights, new generation air-to-air -air missiles like the Meteor and upgraded Scalp cruise missiles. Additionally, Dassault is working with France's Defence Ministry on the upcoming future combat air system, with Rafale set to integrate seamlessly with new generation drones and fighter technology. The Rafale's design philosophy prioritises flexibility and survivability, essential for modern multi-domain operations. It serves as a critical tool for quick response missions, deterrence patrols and airspace control, demonstrating that traditional piloted jets still hold a pivotal role even in an era increasingly focused on unmanned systems. To conclude, the Rafale is not just a fighter jet, it's a symbol of engineering brilliance, tactical versatility and strategic foresight. As technology advances, platforms like Rafale show how innovation keeps air forces ahead in an ever-changing global security environment. Thank you for joining this educational session. Stay curious and keep exploring the skies of knowledge. This video is created for educational purposes only. No copyrighted material was used. Copyright 2025 Vertical Bar Educational Content Initiative.